Um, if you're like me, many of you have switched from Canon, Nikon, something else, over to the new mirrorless Sony system. And uh, it's a wonderful system. Love the files. But the only, only problem I have with the files is uh, with this mirrorless and these uh, bigger files and more detailed files, I'm seeing a lot more moiré patterns showing up. Uh, and you can see that here. Uh, hang on. You can see it right into here. It's that funky kind of uh, pattern where you see some different color shift and, and stuff like that. So um, how do we get rid of that? <laughs> you know, there's a couple of ways you do it in Photoshop, um, but I've never been happy with those. And uh, I started to use Capture One to process these files because I feel like I get a cleaner file. So what I want to show you is real quick how you can fix this in Capture One. And I'm using Capture One 11 point something here. I don't even know which one it is. But um, it's a very easy, very easy fix. Uh, it's, it's a matter of creating... A, a separate layer, a separate adjustment layer, and I'm just going to back up here. And you go up to your uh, your little tool palette up here, and then you click on plus, and you create a separate layer. And you go to up here to your brush tool, and you're going to draw a mask. And you can go into this and, and adjust whatever your hardness level, your flow level, all that kind of so, same kind of thing you can do in in Photoshop. And what I want to do is I want to paint a mask all over where I'm seeing the moray pattern. So I'm just kind of outlining it and I'm just going to fill it in. So yeah, I got about 50% softness on the edges of these. So I just want to get all this filled in. All right, I got that. So I got my mask drawn. Now I go over here to the details tab. Okay. And you scroll down to the details tab and you see right over here it says more I can go in here and then now crank it and it's just going to apply it to this particular layer and you can see it starts to go away and I have to crank it quite a bit because there's some serious moiré and I can take the pattern all the way up and boom it's gone so let's click this off you can see the moiré click it back on moiré be gone all right, so there is a good way to do this in your raw processing with Capture One. Very easy to use tool. You just have to create a new layer, go in and make a uh, draw a layer mask, and then go to your Moiré tool and uh, just pull that slider over until that Moiré disappears. So hopefully this helps, y'all.